So I'm heading to the field uh, to put my combine and Peter's combine um, in transport mode so that we can swap fields because the one that we were cutting now the moisture was reading 20% and that's not good we want it in about let's say less than 15 13 12 something something like that so yeah right, I'm at the combines now you may ask why we leave the augers open because like let's say we we close them then they'll be in the road and we want to park them as close to the road as possible because like when we refuel them we don't have to drive into the field right so what i'm gonna do here is i'm gonna pick the header up let the transport wheels down and then we're gonna track them so i'm gonna start with this one let me start this combine up Right, start it up, lift the header, that should be good right there, also want to pull it back, and you want to pull your reel back as well. Okay, so now you want to take off the hydraulic hoses, like that, put them there, take off the cables, and these cables, put them there, take off your PTO shaft, hook it in there. Want to unhook the header here. Right. And you must lock it here. Let me show you. That's pretty important. You must always make sure that is locked. Okay, for the transport here. You're going to pull out this little pin right here. Drop it down like that. And we got a pin here. That you put in here. You see now it's locked. And uh, let me show you. The first pin that I took out this one and you want to keep this open because you want to put your tongues in here and the clips in there and yeah you want to take this up yeah. right there uh, this side's good all right next up want to take this out Pull that up. You pull this wheel down like that. Pick this up. Turn the wheel. Locks it. And swing it to the other side. Like that. For this side, you're just gonna pick this up, it'll drop down. You put this pin in here. Pick it up. Drops down to there. Take this pin out. Put it in there. Turn the wheel. While I'm on this side, you lock it. Right, now what we do here, it's pretty simple. Take this pin out here. Pick this 
this up, fold this open. Well, let's first get this in here. So this has got to go in that hole. So you gotta pick up on it and you put it in the hole. Shots, got some help. When it's all done, you got this in here. You got this to support the wheel with a pin inside there. Right -o. Now we gotta do like this. The back of the combine there. Let's do the other one. So, we, um, we got a field that we can cut now, so we're going to track the combines over there, Peter is in front, then it's me, then the trucks are going to follow behind. We're at the field now, Peter is just going to pull in here, we're going to wait here on the tar, on the black top, so that he can cut a little circle open for me, so that we don't drive over the wheat, and uh, yeah, I'm going to help him put on his header real quick. Right, we hooked the headers, and we got one truck here. We did cut out a little sample to send to the elevator to get the moisture and now we're waiting for that to see if we must cut or not. Right, so the moisture came back as 14, 13.9. So we're going to start now. Right. And then this steering wheel would appear. And you go into unscreen 2, say start, say accept, and then your auto is good to go. We've finished this field, we're gonna move now. Yeah, see what the next field looks like. Nice, so the moisture is reading 13.7 round about there, so that's good. It's a nice straight um, field this, so I can just chillax. And I've got me some food brewing in the oven. Mince and rice. Yeah. And that'll be ready in about, I'd say, 15 minutes. I'll give it time to about 9 o'clock. Let's say 20 minutes then. And yeah. 
That's it. We don't have much trucks to load. I think we're gonna load this one and then maybe another one. So um, I'll keep you guys updated on uh, what time we finish. Right, it's 11 o'clock. This is my auger cam. Ah, oh, not this is my hopper camera. So as you can see, it's full. Let me show you how it looks outside before I dump out. You just climb on here. Nice and full, you see. Right, I think we are done for the night. We're gonna load this truck now. Sorry for the mess inside here. It was a long day. And, um, yeah. Well, let's just dump out this real quick and see. There is a one truck coming back, but I don't think we have any fields to move to right now. So, 